Hello and welcome to Wednesday's Ramsworld. I'm Gareth Davis. Now we're going to be taking a look at 17-year-old Louis Nightanger today. He's of course set to become an international record breaker again when he steps out for Wales at the Millennium Stadium against Paraguay tonight. Now the team from BBC Wales were up at Moor Farm recently to do a bit of a feature on the rising young star. Here's their report. I've travelled to Derby County's state-of-the-art training facility to meet one of Wales' rising young stars, Lewin Nyatanga. The 17-year-old defender has already captained the under-21 side and there are big things expected for club and country. So, Lewin, we're in the heart of Derby County's training facilities. It looks like there's, there's many great facilities for a young athlete who wants to, to make it as a professional. What's it like here? It's brilliant. You know, one of, the, one of the best facilities in the country. And as a young player, you couldn't really ask to be anywhere else. How did you come to decide, I want to play for Derby County? What happened there? I supported Derby from a, a young age. And I went to the foundation and I got brought up through there to the under nines and got signed. And I've been here ever since. And we're walking down Derby County's Gallery of Honour. And your name sits proudly there on your, your debut shirt. What was it like when you, you made your debut for Derby County, you ran out of Pride Park with that shirt on? It was nervous, but um, it was nerve-wracking, but you know, I've, worked, I've worked all my life for that moment, so it was great. What targets have you set for yourself? And for me, I want to stay in the first team as long as I can, and this year play as many first team games as possible to get as much experience as I can. And what about the dream of one day playing in the Premiership, either with Derby County or if you get a move, how would you feel about that? Definitely, I mean, that's my, that's my main goal, and I just make little goals as well that hopefully will, will make me um, end up in a premiership. So it's been a rapid rise for Naya Tanga, but he still needs to work on his finishing, a point driven home by his teammates. <laughs> he's also showcased his skills at international level and despite being born in England, he's a proud Welshman. Well, Lewin, one of your Welsh shirts here. Obviously, we're all uh, delighted you've chosen to, to play for Wales. Tell us a little bit about your, your Welsh ancestry and how you come to play for Wales. Well, my mum, she was born in Newtown and her family based in Newtown, so that's, that's where I get my um, Welsh background from. Most of my family live in Wales and when I play, they all come and watch me, so it's great. It's a great feeling. I've decided to play for Wales. That's my first choice and I'm not looking back now. And what are your aspirations? I mean, John Toshak has spoken of the need to develop young players for the future. Uh, would, you, would you be thinking of playing in the Euro 2008 qualifiers at some point? Of course, it would be my dream, you know, to play, to play at the Millennium, to play for Wales. You know, but I'll, I'll keep one game at a time and keep looking not too far forward. And hopefully, if I keep doing well, I can get there. Lewin's also up for the Football League Apprentice of the Year Award, which is being contested by some of the best young players across the three divisions of the Coca-Cola Football League. We'll be finding out on Sunday whether Lewin's been successful. Now, thanks for joining us today. We'll be back tomorrow as we start our build-up to the Rams trip to Watford on Saturday.